guys and welcome back to another video on my channel so i know i missed like i think two or three days but here we are back again gonna just keep it going so it took me so long to find this bonnet if you guys seen in my previous videos i have been having like my hair out um and puffy because i've been getting in and out of the water so much it's been like you know it doesn't make sense to get my hair done so i was like i'm not coming on camera without it done or in a bonnet so it took me like an hour to try to find a bonnet and my hair is still like poking out the back of it and the sides and stuff but i'm going to be doing like a little vlog today i'm going to be organizing some stuff i want to show you guys my room because i am doing a updated room tour or a room tour um makeover or whatever towards the end of august so i want you guys to see like how it looks now um, I, have an, I have to make some orders and then I want to tell you guys some new strategies that I want to try out so it's going to be kind of like a business vlog of course um, and that's what we're doing so let me show you guys my room first and tell you guys what I have to do on the to-do list today to film two videos and upload one I'm going to try to make an intro and a banner for my, intro, for my YouTube page and then do some brand um, program for brand ambassadors and you know just promote for me so as far as my room, I'm not going to really go in depth. I'm just going to show you guys what I want to add to my room because I don't dorm at college. So I kind of don't get to redo my dorm like everybody does. Um, so I figured why not make my room comfortable? I work here. I sleep here. I'm in here majority of the time. So why not just make it comfortable for myself when I go back to school? So I do commute now. So I will be home a lot more. Uh, I mean, I drive now. Before I was taking the bus and the train, but I'll be commuting in my car and I'll be, you know, just, you know, you guys know what I'm saying. So I'm going to show you guys what I want to add to my room, ask you guys for any suggestions, and I pretty much figured out exactly what I want and where I want it, so I'm just going to show it to you guys so that when I do the makeover and um, by the end of August, you guys are going to see it and know about it. So. And if you're like me and you work from home, like you have your own business, whatever, in your room or in any part of your house, I really recommend you make it as comfortable as possible because what I have going on right now works for now, but I am going to need more storage. I do need more space for my desk. Like I do need to expand a little bit so it is very important to be comfortable with where you're working where you're going to be studying and stuff like that so just a little side note okay so this is where my office is going to be so long story short my mom redid my room as like a um a birthday present whatever because we had just moved in here and my room was very blank and what all i had was like a bed and a tv so she redid my room and that was when i was 16 I'm pretty sure, or 17, and now I am 19, going to be 20 soon, so I figure I need a new, you know, new look, so a lot of the stuff that I do have in here is a mix of what my mom brought me and what I brought myself, so I'm going to just show you guys, and then you guys tell me any suggestions, so this is going to be my office area, this is going to be where I do my work, and where I study, do homework, everything, so this desk, my mom had got really, really, like, I don't want to say old, but kind of old, so I want to get a new desk. I already have a picture of the desk that I'm going to get. It's $50 from Ikea. The chair I'm going to get is going to be $20. That is called a Snell. It's S-N-I-L-L-E, also from Ikea. Those are both white. The desk should come out from about here to maybe here, just a little bit longer, but it's way bulkier and it's bigger, and it doesn't have this at the end, so I can slide it in comfortably. Um, the chair, I you need to, I want to be comfortable when I'm working, this is not really motivational, you know, it works and it serves its purpose for now, but I gotta upgrade and be comfortable to work, and I need more space on my desk to be able to do all my orders, have my mixer up here, you know, stuff like that. So, um, a new chair coming, new desk coming, um, this is just my Lysol wipes and like little palettes I'm giving to my cousin, so all that stuff is like irrelevant. Um, this is for fly sprays because, you know, mos mosquitoes and stuff be trying it. But here's my little whiteboard that you guys have probably seen. This is from Dollar Tree, but I actually want to go to Home Depot and get a big white. Um, I watched somebody on Instagram and they said they can get, like, you can go to Home Depot and get the big, thin, white, dry erase board for, like, $5 or something. It's not the ones with the dates. It's just, like, one piece of, you know whiteboard and it's pretty cheap so i'm gonna see if i can fill up this whole area right here so that i can have just like a way bigger one of this um this is my little ring light this works perfectly right now as far as videos and stuff i do want to get a bigger ring light um just for the purpose of 
youtube but this honestly does the job guys this is from amazon it was like 15 dollars and if you don't have a ring light yet and you don't want to pay for a ring light yet i really suggest to do this um yeah i even used it when i was doing makeup and it has three settings like yellowish white and then real yellow and then back to the white i use the white because the white is you know whatever this is my basket so this will stay this is my printer so this is gonna also stay this is a little desk that i used to like fold out you guys probably seen before and then i'm gonna get another one of these from walmart Th these were like 11 dollars i'm gonna get another one and stack it on top and then put the printer on top and then get rid of this black brownish desk right here um so then you know that'll give me enough space for now until i outload my, my room but that'll give me enough space until i get there and my posters are gonna say i just want to keep i always want to put the whiteboard right there so as far as here all this going to be changing is the desk the chair i'm getting another thumb another thing of that and stacking it printer will be on top and the whiteboard and that's pretty much it um i'm not going to show you guys my bed and stuff so i keep my big storage so i was thinking about buying a new one because i put my printer on here when i first got it um have you guys you guys probably seen that and it bent it in so it's kind of hard to open and close this so I'm debating if I want to just take this off and like bend it out to straighten it or if I want to just buy a new one. I was going to get white but then I was like I already have that. It doesn't really make sense to get the white one. I already have it. So um, I'll just try, probably try to fix this out and then whatever. So this is going to be the same. I will be organizing this today and this today. It. I do have a small room so if you have a small room too and you're wondering like how can you work in your how, how can you work from your room like when your room is small uh, this is nail polish like i'm just over this chair um, but yeah after that i will be done with my room right before school starts and then from there i'll be able to just get right into the flow my room is fine now like i'm grateful for everything that i have but i've had i have had everything um furniture wise i've never had a headboard um since I had a twin size bed, so I was like, no, I really, really want to, um, you know, just upgrade. I want to just upgrade. So I think this is gonna just be bent regardless. It's gonna be a little hard um, to open it. This one at least, because you guys see how it pops open. to sweep but um I'll show you guys what this is where all my supplies are ingredients supplies like um inventory but obviously I am out tough I'm ordering some stuff today pick it up because today today is mail is stuff so I have to relabel these on the side <laughs> okay so I re redid everything down here the last thing is like my um the supplies I used to make it like my mixer and, and my spatulas and stuff this is ingredients and then this is inventory i'm obviously completely out and then um mailers and stuff like that up there and then over here is like the first job is everything that you would have in an office like label maker paper clips thumb tags white out um tape stuff like that pretty much and then the last one is just my burlap sacks. I'm trying to get rid of these as fast as I can. Piece of tape. Um, but you know, I don't know. It's making my orders way more. So I'm debating how and <laughs> how I'm gonna get rid of these. I don't know. I don't really want them as part of my um uh lineup anymore. It just makes it heavier. I have to charge more for it, so I don't know, I'm figuring that out. But yeah. So right now I'm going to make an order for a customer that has to go out today and um, this one is easy to make. i making like short clips and stuff and trying to get my stuff to go viral because I'll be seeing like that's really a big boost and I feel like the next, the next step for my brand and my business is to get more exposure so I will be looking for brand ambassadors. I'll do a video on that. Um, you obviously have to master criteria. Um, 
contract we'll talk about all that stuff but um right now i'm just really focused on outreach and outreach and outreach and trying to get my stuff across to as many people and pages as i can so that's what i'm going to do right now if it comes out successful then i'll post a clip um if not you won't see anything so i'll see you guys <laughs> Okay, so the time is around 12.30 and I think I've been pretty productive today. I basically created a new product. It's called Golden Hour. It is a body butter shimmer, but it's like all shimmer. Um, obviously the same components of my regular butters, but they just have a way more shimmer. Limited edition, I'm probably only gonna have it for about two weeks. So I did that. I made a TikTok, I'm in my Twitter. I'm about to sit down. And write out some so on my twitter if you guys follow me on my twitter it is at kp natural p r o d my name got cut off and i post um daily um skin and self-care tips over there so go follow me on twitter we post my stuff um then my tiktok is just to show like little glimpses of me making my products um so i put my tiktok on the screen um you can find me there at kp natural products and then i'm about to get on facebook but i'm about to sit down and write down some self-care tips so i can post it through on my twitter throughout the week um yeah and i'll show you guys my new product on the screen the golden hour it's gonna drop tonight and it'll be the same price as my other butter but it's not gonna be here for long um i'm getting rid of a whole bunch of stuff i have a whole new collection coming in come september it's gonna be called back to the basics and the shimmers are going to be gone the golden hour butter is going to be gone the refresh is going to be gone only thing that might stay is the rose water so if you guys have not shopped my um, my line make sure you guys go shop i also have a summer spritz kit still up so if you live somewhere like la or atlanta where it's like warm a lot of the of the um time like a lot of the year then i really suggest you get it i really don't have a lot left and it's 25 dollars. you get a body shimmer a rose water and a refresher so i suggest you go get that and lucky you you get to be warm all summer all year round most of the year round but over here it's only hot for like three months so i'm about to it's going to be discontinued afterwards so make sure you guys go shop go shop go shop so right now, like I said, I'm about to eat. Write down some tips for my um Twitter. Watch some Office. I love the Office. If you guys don't know, I love it. And I don't know. I'll probably end up doing that for like another hour or two. Keep working for an hour or two, and I'll probably get dressed and go out. I like to do my work in the morning. These are what my if I could plan my perfect day, they would look like this. Like wake up. I was up at seven. I babysit my cousin sometimes, so I picked him up. He's in the living room. And then I literally just, if I could, I would just eat and then work, 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 work up until about, normally up until about 12, 1, um, probably 1, I would work until, and then I would go outside and, you know, live my life. Okay, guys, that is the end of this video. I'm about to go out. My work is done. Um, this is kind of what I talked about in my other video about being, like, giving yourself a break, work, and then still have time for play. So I worked. It's probably about 3 o'clock right now, and I'm about to go out and head out. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Make sure you guys comment, subscribe, join my giveaway. If you have not seen that video, it's like I think a video or two back. A video or two back. Go watch that video. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Subscribe and shop KP Natural Products.